We have all heard of hydrogen being the next big thing in the propulsion business, but there still are issues around it. And some crazy folks have gone on to make engines that run on water. But feasibility is a big thing to consider, and that is where e-fuels could make a lot of sense. Or at least Porsche would like the world to believe that. It is bullish on synthetic gasoline, and that's why it has poured over $75 million into acquiring a 12.5% stake in a Chilean company that makes this stuff. Check this out. Porsche, with several partners, has started producing green gasoline to save internal combustion engines. The company claims that its e-fuel is climate neutral and aimed at replacing regular gasoline in vehicles with traditional internal combustion engines. For this, highly innovative fuels launched the Haru Oni e-fuels pilot plant in Chile in December 2022. Situated just outside the windy Punta Arenas region, this area allows the plant's wind turbines to run at peak efficiency, up to four times as frequently as they do in the windiest spots in Germany. The e-fuel making process begins by splitting water into its constituent components, hydrogen and oxygen. The latter is released into the atmosphere. Next, carbon dioxide is extracted either from the surrounding air or bio-waste. After this, hydrogen and carbon dioxide are synthesized to create methanol. The methanol gets converted into gasoline in the final step. Using e-fuels would allow for an 85% reduction in CO2 emissions. Moreover, since wind turbines provide the electricity for electrolysis, the production becomes almost carbon neutral. In the pilot phase, e-fuel production of around 130,000 litres per year is planned at Haruoni. Initially, the fuel will be used in lighthouse projects such as the Porsche Mobile One Super Cup and the Porsche Experience Centres. By 2026, the production is expected to scale up to 55 million litres of fuel annually.